It takes one of NASA's most powerful tools, the James Webb Telescope, to capture images of outer space like this one you see here. But lately, NASA scientists are turning their focus inward mm. toward Earth. The agency is gathering data on how our planet is changing in its latest climate report. NASA says 2022 was the globe's fifth hottest year on record. That's all part of a long-term trend that's attributed to warming and to climate change that's caused by humans. CBS senior national and environmental correspondent Ben Tracy takes us inside the space program's new Earth focused missions to help us better understand our rapidly warming world. And lift off. When you think of NASA, this is probably what comes to mind. But with our own planet now undergoing dramatic and devastating changes, NASA is turning its eyes back towards Earth. NASA is the tip of the spear for climate change. Randy Friedel is deputy director of Earth Science at NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California. He points to NASA's new Earth System Observatory, a series of five advanced satellite missions that will monitor nearly every aspect of our planet, from bedrock to atmosphere. We turn with a renewed focus to our home planet of Earth. It will give NASA a 3D view of how the Earth systems are operating and impacted by climate change. Are you kind of looking at the vital signs of planet Earth? That's exactly what we're doing. And really looking at the heartbeat of the planet. Just a, a whole host of things that we are tracking every single day. And the liftoff. In December, NASA launched a rocket from California carrying a satellite called SWAT, which stands for Surface Water and Ocean Topography. This $1.2 billion mission is the first radar to survey almost all of the world's surface water, nearly every ocean, river, lake, and stream on the planet. Basically, this thing can survey 6 million bodies of water every three weeks? Yeah, that's right. It can cover everything. So. Project scientist Paul Rosen says SWAT will help to better detect and plan for floods, droughts, and rising seas, which are expected to make many coastal areas around the world uninhabitable in the decades to come. And this is a NASA animation of its upcoming mission, NISAR, scheduled to launch next year in a joint project with India's space program. The satellite will use two different radar systems to track subtle changes in Earth's surface to less than a half inch. And NASA plans to share the data from all of these missions with scientists and governments to better understand and adapt to climate change. So you've been working on this for more than 10 years. Yes. How excited are you to get this thing up there? Words cannot express how excited I am to get this thing up there. It's very exciting to me. And it's one more set of eyes in the sky NASA will have staring back at Earth. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Pasadena, California.